Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala told us in the Quran, whomsoever desires the harvest of the hereafter, we increase for him his harvest. And whomsoever need the harvest or seeking the harvest of this dunya, we give him only what's decreed for him and he has no share in the hereafter. And I will fill your hands with provision and rizq. Yabna Adam, la tuba'id minni. O son of Adam, do not distance yourself from me. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said in the other hadith al-Qudsi, and my abd keeps coming close to me with the optional ibadat until I love him. Until I love him. Do not distance yourself from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Otherwise, amla'u qalbaka faqran. I will fill your heart with poverty. You will be a multi-millionaire. But you're always worried. You're always in need of others. You're sleepless. Amla'u qalbaka faqran. Your heart is poor. You might have a lot of wealth, but you're always feeling like worried. Busy all the time. Listen to this. Rasulullah sallallahu said, Whomsoever the akhirah is his goal, is his main concern, Allah will fix all his affairs and will gather all his family. And the dunya will come to him ghasman anha, raghima. And the dunya will come to that person, whether it likes it or not. It will come running to that person who made the akhirah as his main concern. The dunya will come running to him. And whomsoever the dunya is his main concern, he will lose both. Wow. Allah said, O mankind, the promise of Allah is true. Don't be fooled by this dunya. And don't let the shaitan fool you. The world is three days. As for yesterday, it has vanished along with all that was in it. As for tomorrow, you might not see it. And as for today, that's all you got. So take advantage of every single moment.